EA's FIFA or FC series is one of the most popular football games on the planet, but as good as they are, they always run into some sort of weird issues. My name is Yadullah, you're watching Ganeta Technology and in this video we're talking about how you can fix EA's FC24 not opening or launching on your system. The first thing that we're going to do is enable a secure boot. Now you can't really enable this in uh, your system. You're going to have to go to your UEFI settings. How do you do that? Well, you press Windows key plus I to head over to Windows settings. And we are just going to search for UEFI here. And you will get the option of changing advanced startup options. So we'll click on that. And uh, then right here under recovery options, you will see advanced startup. Go ahead and click restart now and this will take you to your BIOS settings where you will be able to enable secure boot. Secure boot is required for the game because uh, the anti-cheat works on a kernel level and it needs to make sure that the system is protected and integrity is kept as it is. So just enable secure boot, uh, it only does you good. Next up, if secure boot is enabled, your next order of business is to run the game and Steam as an administrator. And doing this is uh, incredibly easy just open the start menu and search for steam then in here i'm going to click on open file location which will take me to the shortcut for all the steam programs i'm going to right click this again click on properties and then you will see the open file location button right here go ahead and click that and it will take you to the main executable steam file i'm going to right click this go to properties and under compatibility i will see the option of running the program as an administrator so make sure you check that go ahead and click apply then go ahead and click ok restart steam and then uh, fc should start working fine if running steam as an admin didn't help you can also try running the game as an administrator but the process of finding the game's location is a little difficult so open up steam head over to your library right click fc24 go ahead click on manage and then click on browse local files this will open up the local files folder uh, where all of the ea fc24 files are fixed and you will see fc24.exe go ahead and right click it click on properties head over to compatibility and you will see the same run program as an administrator option check it click apply click ok restart the game and it should start working next step you should try restarting the ea app now whether you have the game on steam or on the ea app you need the ea app for fifa to be able to run which is a bit of a bother and if you don't have the ea app running in the background like in my case as you can see there is no ea app here uh, FC can sometimes give problems. So we're just going to manually launch the EA app just so I can show you how this works. All right, so the EA app is now open. I'm just going to close it. And now if I go to my task bars app section, you can see that the EA app is right here. So right click and then click on exit. And now you can go ahead and launch the EA app again from the start menu. Give it a little bit of time to open up and then try launching FC again. Another solution you can try is to enable the EA app's background services. These services keep your game and the EA app up to date. And sometimes when you launch the game directly, it just isn't running on the latest update. Now, this can be different if you have the game running via Steam because Steam also updates the game. But just for good measure, you can try updating it or enabling the feature. So click on these three uh, bars, then click on settings, head over to the application tab and just make sure that the enable ea background services or enable background services slider is enabled once you're done with this close the app restart it and then try launching the game again last but not least uh, you should try um, repairing the ea anti-cheat now how this works is that you need to launch steam and you need to go to the game's default uh, installation location so right click FC, go to manage, then click on browse local files. Now in here you will see a few options. We are going to go to installer. Then we are going to click on uh, EA anti-cheat. Double click to that and you will see the EA anti-cheat installer. Double click to run the file. It will ask you for permissions and stuff. 
and we're right here so in the drop down you can select what ea game you have installed on your system i have fc24 which it shows installed and now i have a bunch of options so i can uninstall the anti-cheat i can update the anti-cheat i can repair the anti-cheat i'm just going to go ahead and try to repair it it wants to know where the game is installed just the folder so in this window uh, you're going to have to go to wherever your steam library is installed in my case it's on d drive in a folder under steam library steam apps then common then fc24 and then that's it you select the folder and as you can see it has already started uh, extracting the resources and repairing the anti-cheat once this process is complete you can go uh, restart your pc that's the more important bit and then try launching the game again if you like this video consider subscribing give us a thumbs up as the bell icon and tell us in the comments below what more such content can we make for you if you'd like to know more about tech visit our website candid.technology follow us on social media follow me on instagram and twitter and we'll see you in the next video